I can see what they're doing, what he's doing. I can see it, I feel it. I can, I can, he's cooking. <laughs> So apparently the script for Man of Steel 2 sucked more cock than a Reddit old housewife going through her midlife crisis on a Taco Tuesday midnight special. So a report came out saying Man of Steel 2 featuring Henry Cavill's script was so bad that the studio hired James Gunn to reboot it with Superman Legacy leading to the Witcher stars DCU ado. Now again this is a report I don't know how factual this is and to be honest I think it's bullshit but again let's speculate and let's have some fun whether or not let's see if we can decipher and whether or not this is actually true the wild nature of things that happened with henry cavill at the dcu after james gunn took the boss chair with peter saffron are still making headlines and the buzz around it refuses to fade while the actor must have made peace with the fact that he's no longer going to be playing the superman role that fans love and still have hopes that he will get his redemption one day that's not going to happen the internet still seems some hope as netizens continue demanding his return but new reports uh show talk about man of steel 2 that was reportedly greenlit with henry cowell's comeback and it isn't happy up and it is not a happy update either well yeah i mean apparently henry, henry cavill got screwed henry cavill loved superman warner brothers screwed him hard so i have no ill will towards henry cavill as a matter of fact if if, if by some miracle if james gunn were to say to Henry Cavill, hey, come back for one more role. If I was Henry Cavill, I would say go fuck yourself. And I would never, ever go back to playing Superman or work for Warner Brothers again. I would go to Marvel and, and hope for a, a bigger role in that MCU universe. But that's just me. And I think Henry Cavill is much too kind to be like me. <laughs> For the for the universe, the climax of Dwayne Johnson star Black Adam had given the biggest surprise to the fans of Snyderverse at the scene as it confirmed that Henry Cavill is coming back as Superman. Soon it was reported that the actor will also get a sequel to his standalone movie, Man of Steel 2, but within a couple of weeks, Gunn came on board and axed both the movie and Cavill's feature as Clark Kent. Well, again, I talked about this in a separate video like months ago where he didn't sign a contract. He shaked the hand of whoever was in charge at Warner Brothers and on bad faith or good faith, however you want to see it, believed the executives of Warner Brothers that Henry Cavill will continue on as Superman instead of signing a fucking contract like he should have done or his manager at the time, Danny Garcia, should have done and maybe he would have still been Superman. Oh, so stupid, bro. So stupid. No reasons were given as to why James Gunn chose to discontinue Henry Cavill as Superman. Well, well, we know now that that James Gunn wanted a younger Superman and set out to find uh, on a hunt to find a completely new set for actors for his Superman legacy, which we know now is David Corn Sweat. But that still remains a mystery. It's not anymore. The latest update talk about Man of Steel 2 script that came to Warner Brothers bosses and how they rejected it up front. Interesting. Which, again, I don't know how true this is. This could all be bullshit. I don't know. I really don't trust this. But, you know, we'll see. As per a fandom write, writer report. Oh, God. The Man of 2 script that came way to Warner Brothers was so bad that they chose not to go ahead with it at all. As they were extremely displeased with the plot of the script and people have high hopes from DC movies. They didn't want to risk a failure with a Superman movie so they brought in James Gunn and decided to reboot it with Superman Legacy. With James Gunn having a completely new vision for, the, for his yet undisclosed Superman Legacy, Henry Cavill might not have fit into the parameters he was looking for. However, fans are still hoping uh, and will continue to to find that a cavalry return as the Kryptonian prince someday in the future. That's not gonna happen. Like, Henry Cavill is done as Superman. He's not coming back as Superman. Like, th those days are over. It's done. And the Snyder cultists can bitch and cry and whine and make stupid ass videos that nobody gives a fuck about anymore. And hashtag restore Snyderverse that nobody gives a fuck about anymore all day long until their fucking hands fucking break, which I hope they do one day. <laughs> <laughs> I hope all the Snyder cultists go in a large school yellow bus and they drive off a fucking cliff and they all fucking burn screaming. In Minecraft, of course, in Minecraft. But I really fucking hate these people, bro. Like, these people are just slightly above... I, I was not going to say that. 
I'm not gonna say it. Oh man, I really despise these people. Again, Snyder cultist, Snyder cultist, because I know there are some fucking brain dead people out there. Truth, whoa, 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 whoa. why are you attacking Zack Snyder fans? Snyder cultist, are you deaf, dumb, and fucking blind? I know your mom and dad had sex with each other, and now came your fucking retarded ass. But listen to me one more time, Snyder cultist. Not Zack Snyder fans, which I am a Zack Snyder fan. I'm just not a fucking Zack Snyder cum guzzler like most of these people are. Ah, <sighs> anyway, <laughs> listen. At the end of the day, Henry Cavill got to play Superman, and listen, he was robbed. We all know it. He was screwed over. We all know it. Uh, Man of Steel was great. He was completely overshadowed and fucked over in Batman v Superman. And in Zack Snyder's Just League, where you have a fucking four-hour movie, he was in the movie for like what? 15 minutes, 10 minutes at best, at best. You have a fucking four hour Justice League movie where Superman is barely in it. Make that make sense, daddy -o. Anyway, good for Henry Cavill. He can move on. I hope he, I hope like, I, hope, I, I really hope that Henry Cavill lands a big IP like James Bond or he joins the MCU as a main character, Dr. Doom. That would be fucking awesome. Uh, because Henry Cavill deserves it because Henry Cavill is a fucking cool dude and he was completely screwed over as Superman So that's gonna be it as far as this report goes. I don't really buy it I mean it comes from Phantom Wire, which is you know, we all know that's a fucking that's a trash rag of a fucking site But you know <laughs> Stranger things have happened, right? Truth is sometimes stranger than fiction. So that's gonna be it. Hit like, subscribe, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Discord, TikTok. This is that chicks. Let me know in the comments down below. What do you think of this news? Either way, Henry Cavill, he, he doesn't need Superman. He can move on. And we have a great Superman in, in David Corn Sweat and, and Superman Legacy and a thriving DC universe that we're sure to follow. And all the Snyder cultists can cry in their fucking mom's basement. Ooh. I, I I hate you, James God. I hate you. Go get some fucking pussy, you fucking virgin betas, bitches. <laughs> Love you all. Stay safe. Truth. Oh, 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 mommy. Out. The game ain't in me no more. None of it.